So how should the international community deal with North Korea to curb its continued threats? What kinds of collaborations need to be made and what are the challenges? Well, leading minds in regional security issues gathered in Seoul today to discuss just that. Our Kwon Soa digs in. Victor Cha, a U.S. expert on North Korea, said at a South Korean think tank's annual forum in Seoul Wednesday, he won't be surprised if Pyongyang conducts a ballistic missile launch or nuclear test before May 6, and shared his thoughts on what needs to be done then. I think uh, China needs to stop unconditionally all fuel and coal, fuel into North Korea and stop the import of coal from from North Korea. And, um, and I think that uh, the United States has to move to secondary sanctioning of third country companies that are doing any business with North Korea, including Chinese companies. Cha stressed the power of the UN Security Council Resolution 2270, but that 80 percent of it depends on China's implementation. An interesting point, he added, was this. If the North Koreans do a fifth, fifth nuclear test, I don't think that reflects the ineffectiveness of the sanctions. This as he sees the fifth nuke test as a desire to develop its nuclear program before its Congress meeting rather than a defiance to the world. If the test does happen, Cha says multilateral meetings are essential, including one with Seoul and Beijing. I think there's increasing willingness on the Chinese side to be open to more trilateral dialogue with the United States and the ROK. Wang Dong, a Chinese expert, agrees to a certain extent. Well, I think, you know, frankly, the, the six-party talks is just a framework. It's a label. Personally, I don't see any problem of, of, of doing that. Uh, but of course, always uh, keep the, the door open to North Korea. If they change mind, they're always welcome. This is why the expert says Seoul and Washington's rejection of Pyongyang's foreign minister's deal to halt nuclear tests if the two allies stop their joint military drills was a missed opportunity. Uh, the, the right way, right thing to do is really to accept, not reject. The, the, the TPRK proposal, because then you will put uh, the, the North Korea uh, sort of uh, in a spot, right? Then it has to say whether it's wanted to move on or it's going to sort of move away. If it's move away from the, the, the proposal itself put forward, then of course it, it, it will lose credibility, right? This reflects Beijing's dual-track approach on its longtime ally, a no-go for South Korea and the U.S. at this point. Kwon Soa, Arirang News.